Now what? Lopez having a tete a tete with referee Speedy Nelson. He he do and he'll clean it up. I got some tissues here. Is that what that is? It's a conversation. Uh, Finally, collar and elbow tie up. Thanks for staying with us. We're in hour number eight of this match. There's a bisco indeed. Nice drop toe hold from Dreamer. Nice float over into her front face. Why to say both these competitors are trying to feel each other out? No jokes, please, Scott. I mean, La Labs isn't here. Yeah, I said no joke. Oh. Just takes me back. Lance and Lopez this week on Wild Side. Don't expect any quick pins so quite so early on in the match. I believe both guys really want to strut their stuff here this week. Despite what Jeremy Lopez says, he is not that well thought of by the fans in Osaka Pro. They do the same thing to him the fans here at NWA Wild Center are doing. He just doesn't speak Japanese. Yeah, he doesn't know what rude things they're saying. I assume they're rude. Look at the float over by Lopez. That's classic amateur wrestling. A dreamer, nice reversal into a waist lock. Slide out into the ropes. There are no ropes in amateur wrestling. I'd like to point that out. That's true, but it's also not an amateur wrestling match. Hell, we're pros here at Wildside. Well, I understand we're, that. We're, we're pros doing, he's doing, I beg your pardon, but he's doing the float out, the float over, the escape, the front face. He's amateur wrestling, and then the minute he gets the table turned, he goes to the ropes. In all honesty, all the float overs, whatever, it's all part of the psychological arsenal of one Jeremy Lopez. Well, it's, knowing Jeremy Lopez, it's probably all he's got in the psychological arsenal. Wow. Connor Neville tie up. Waist lock go behind by Lopez into a full Nelson. Reversal into another full Nelson by Lance Dreamer. And once again into the. Oh, look at that! Well, that's one the, way out of it. Those are the rules of professional wrestling last I checked. <laughs> he broke it. Uh, kind of, sort of. Uh-oh. Now he's, okay. Gee, where's this one going to go? All right. Lance, do the right thing. You know what to do. That's it. And dropping young Jero on his head in the process. Ouch. Kirk, you too? Do you, they, feel, do you feel his pain? Are they here? Yeah, they're all here. Along with Budgie Flynn. Okay, enough inside jokes for this uh, five minute break here. Jarlo, very thin skin, letting the fans get to him. Oh, back into the ring the hard way. Unfortunately for Jeremy Lopez, he takes the emotions of the crowd to heart, and that will ultimately be his downfall. Oh, dear. Ooh. A low shot and another shot right to the head. Knocks down Lance Dreamer. From the basement to the second floor, Lopez just rocked Lance Dreamer. Now putting the boots to him in the corner. The referee calling for the break. Taking every advantage of that five count before breaking that onslaught is Jeremy Lopez. I think Lopez needs to keep that onslaught a little bit more uh, lively. Ooh. Not giving young Lance Dreamer a chance to gather his wits and get that second win. Snap on that suplex out of the corner. Lackadaisical cover. Dreamer roll the shoulder in two. The pride that Lopez has will, could ultimately be his downfall here. He needs to be relentless. A Malenko cover may have won that match for Jarlow right there. Well, Malenko couldn't make it. He was uh, driving Carino in it. I don't mean that. Oh. Maybe Debbie Malenko, but not. Ooh. Now look at this. Blatantly using the top rope as a chokehold. It's been done before. And he has it till the count of five to break it. Kelly to back souple from Jerlo. And once again with this back press cover. Dreamer rolls the shoulder. What is Lopez trying to accomplish with that back press? I don't understand. I mean, the few matches that I saw of Jeremy Lopez or Osako Pro, he didn't do any of that lackadaisical back cover during for pin attempts. I don't think, I think he believes that all American wrestlers are weak and not worthy of his talent. He's an American wrestler. Whoa! Russian leg sweep out of the corner. Cover, no. Out of the clear blue sky, definitely surprised Jeremy Lopez, but not enough to get that pin. But look at Lopez, always knowing his ring positioning. Graced himself in the corner, caught him with the boot. Now into the top turnbuckle, boot to the back of the head from Lopez. 
We certainly don't want to discount Jeremy Lopez. However, Lopez better not be discounting the ability of Lance Streamer. If he treats Lance Streamer very lightly, young Mr. Lopez is in for a rude surprise. Butterfly double underhook up top into a suplex. Hooks the arm, side press, and Dreamer pull the shoulder up at two. Maybe if Lopez did a little bit more work on these pins and maybe tied some legs up, he might have had a victory by now. But Lance Dreamer has really been, whoa, what a drop kick, standing drop kick from Jeremy Lopez. Picture perfect, hit Lance Dreamer right in the mush. No, Dreamer. Give him every ounce of credit there is to give. He has taken the best that Lopez has to offer and still rolls that shoulder. I'm not quite sure that the longer this match goes, if it's more to the advantage of uh, Dreamer or Lopez. But we've seen, I've seen Lance, uh, I've seen Jeremy Lopez involved in 15, 20 minute matches. Oh, oh, oh dear, a DDT with authority. And both Dreamer and Lopez seem to be down for the count. What snap on that DDT from Dreamer, but Dreamer still feeling the effects. Lopez has thrown everything in the kitchen sink. At last, Dreamer, but Lopez just took a stiff snap DDT in the middle of the ring. Both men fighting to get up to one knee. Both men back vertical. Dreamer strikes first with a shot to the gut and a right hand. Staggers Lopez, a second one drops it. Oh! Face first full of turnbuckle, a reversal from young Mr. Lopez. Oh, man. And he meets an elbow for his efforts. Back elbow, drop kick from the middle turnbuckle. Dreamer. Man, Dreamer's on fire. He may smell victory here, Lopez. Up on top, cross body, got it. How on earth did Lopez kick out of that? If you want to put a fraction on that one, that'd be a 2.99 with no problem. The but momentum certainly has shifted the direction of Lance Dreamer, Jeremy Lopez has been staggered. The Osaka Pro Superstar being handed his hat here in Wildside. And the more relentless Lance Dreamer is, pin it to oh. oh, still not enough. The more relentless Lance Dreamer is, the more it will pay dividends. I think he has Lopez where he wants him. He better not relent. Shoots him across, no, reversal. Dreamer into the ropes, ducks a clothesline. Dreamer ducks it, go behind by Lopez. Single butterfly into a DDT. Beautifully done. Wow, it's over. What a maneuver. Gentlemen, the winner of the match, Jeremy Lopez. Put the single butterfly, wrapped him up, and the DDT. Dreamer had no way to break the impact, and he is still down.